Welcome to Live in the Messiah's Love. I'm your host, Kamisha. Welcome back. We have a special episode today. Uh, my beloved is here. And before we get into this episode, let's just pray. Honey, will you pray for us, please? Absolutely. Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord. We thank you for you. Mm-hmm. Who you are, our, our God, the creator of the heavens and the earth, Lord, and all that's in it. Mm-hmm. We thank you for all that you've done in our lives, for sending your son, for sending us your Holy Spirit to lead us and guide us in all truth, wisdom, knowledge, and things to come, Mm -hmm. to make us, help us become more conformed to the image of your son, our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. Yes, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you so much. We thank you for the authority, the dominion the power and all that that you have given to us mm-hmm. and and through your son yes. to utilize the almighty name of Jesus to accomplish your will, your plan, your purpose, and your covenant, bringing earth, making earth look and function here as it is in heaven. Yes, Lord. We thank you. We especially thank you for your blood that purifies us, cleans us, washes us white as snow Mm -hmm. without any spot, wrinkle, or blemish, Lord. And we thank you for what you are doing here and in in and through us and in and through all the things that you've given us in building up your end-time army, making those that are going through this course your elite warriors, your end-time army to bring in your end time harvest, Lord. Mm-hmm. Knowing that none of us could do any of this in and of ourselves, where it says it very plainly, without you, we can do nothing. Mm-hmm. And with you, nothing is impossible. We can do all things yes, through you. Yes, Lord. Our, our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. Mm-hmm. So we thank you and give you all the glory, the honor, and the praise that is due you. In the almighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' almighty name. Amen. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. Thank you, Lord, for all the growth that you've brought through us and to us. We appreciate you, Lord. Thank you, sweetheart, for praying for us. You have reached the completion of basic training and boot camp. So congratulations. Congratulations. Amen. (laughs) I had the the little noisemaker. Um We have reached the end of our basic training boot camp section. So congratulations for making it to the end. We have enjoyed this time with you and this time with the Lord. And we just want to encourage you. We're done with this section, but there's more to come. So we are going to end our season here, but we'll be back June 14th of this year which is a friday and we'll be ready to go with the ait section which stands for what any advanced individual training amen i'm really looking forward to getting into the ait mm-hmm. advanced individual training um if you can hear what the acronym ait stand for stands for it's getting more into looking at you personally as god's warrior so we'll be doing some things there um to build upon that foundation of basic training. While we are away, keep in mind that what makes an elite warrior is the one who does the basics really well. Amen. So take the time to continue to review these lessons and um, spend time with God, spend time in prayer, continue with God, continue exactly what we've learned and we've taught you thus far. You may have imagined in your mind that basic training would include more, but God is faithful. He knows exactly what's needed (laughs) on that layer, that level, and then he'll build upon the next. So take this time to master these concepts that the Lord has shared with you. You know, just a little bit of a look back for me in my life. These are things that God taught me over at least a decade, (laughs) at least a decade. And um, was it been nine or 10 months or so is certainly, it's been impactful. It has been, um, hard hitting if you will, but you still need to make it second nature to you to do these things. Go ahead, sweetheart. So uh, I want to share this as 
it is of the utmost importance, right? Mm -hmm. Um, whether looking back at my own experience or, or the, the observation experience of others, right? Mm -hmm. Their, their time in also even natural militaries, the focus and the importance of boot camp is vital mm -hmm. and not, not that you remain there, mm -hmm. but the lessons that each individual learns while they're there, mm -hmm. if they deviate from that is when they run in and have issues mm -hmm. and later on in there, well, in the natural, your careers, right? Mm -hmm. But so here we're talking about our walk in the Lord, mm -hmm. being able to have those lessons that were de learned and developed in boot camp, continuing to utilize them, to apply them to your life is of the utmost importance. Mm -hmm. Because as you said, honey, honey, uh, even with special forces, they do the basics extremely well. Mm -hmm. So still, I want to encourage you, go back and listen to the episodes again. Mm -hmm. Hone and fine tune and develop those skill sets, right? Mm -hmm. But also have that, the, the lessons, but the word written on the tablet of your heart mm -hmm. so that it, it becomes second nature. It's like breathing. You don't even have mm -hmm. to think about it. Mm -hmm. You're just doing it. Now, we don't have to think about it. We just bring everything to the Lord, right? And he's the one that supplies the answer of what we're to, where we're to go, what we're to say, and what we're to do. Amen. But having that, now I'll say heart towards the Lord and mindset is vital moving forward. Amen. And that is a second nature response. Exactly. You're not like, wait, what was that again? Let me go get that paper again, <laughs> which is okay. <laughs> Let me dig have through all these, that, these but, notes. Yes. But it's better if it's a reactionary response. It's second nature to you versus wait, hold on devil. I got to go find out what to say that you already know to bring it before the Lord. And it, it is, um, but also muscle that, memory. that you're, you're continuing to develop your time in prayer and the different types of prayer that we've covered thus far, mm -hmm. all right, those, and, and I'll say not just, okay, I checked the box, mm -hmm. but that it becomes a, a joy, a delight in your mm -hmm. life and you're, in, you're continuing to increase, building up that, I'll say, uh, threshold of endurance that Amen. you have, Amen. Uh, you know, for prayer and, and whatever else the Lord requires, those, those skill sets of conducting warfare or waging warfare right mm -hmm. and and fine-tuning those things just and again this is just the basics Amen. there is more that we are going to learn mm -hmm. and develop while we are moving forward throughout the other phases of training amen and if you're a mom or a dad or a sister or brother or anything like that and you have young ones start teaching your kids the things that you're learning don't Amen. wait until you have um you feel like you've already figured everything out 100 percent and mastered it teach them as teach them to your family as you grow and as you go because it gives them a better standing because time does not stand still and those little ones are going to grow up before you know it so you might as well impart the word of god the solid word of God into their lives and work on it together. You can together. absolutely start them while they're, while they're young, while Amen. they're little children on the path towards becoming, uh, if you will, elite warriors for the Lord Amen. and, and how, his end time army. Amen. And how beautiful is that for you to stand side by side with your, your children as Amen. they grow up into warriors for the Lord and they're doing spiritual warfare and not afraid in any way, shape or form of the adversary or the tactics or afraid to get into the word it becomes second nature to them it's mm -hmm. the sooner you know how to do that the better so congratulations once again we'll be looking forward to seeing you or being right back here with you june 14th um, in between go to the website at dayofprayer.org look at god's warriors um, series to go back and revisit anything you need to but also check out some of our other podcasts because those will still be going forward as we continue to pursue christ in absolute obedience to everything that he tells us to do um, if you have questions please don't hesitate to reach out to us we always love you we're always praying for you and remember to live your life in the messiah's love god bless you want to know more about a day of prayer Sign up for our newsletter where you'll get the latest updates on the ministry, inspiring messages, and coupon codes for the merch shop. 
Visit our website, adayofprayer.org. Click on Connect in the menu bar and complete the form. Be sure to check the box that says subscribe.